Hello everyone, today I am going to teach you how we can create Flutter plugin and we will also see how we can send and receive data with native code. Basically, I am going to fetch some device information into our native code and we will access those variables into our Flutter project. So let's start. Choose new Flutter project and then select Flutter SDK and then choose your directory where you want to create your Flutter project. Uncheck Linux, Mac OS, Wave, Windows and then select project type as plugin and click on this create button. You can see our project is creating. Now it's created. So this is the project file example project file and here uh, we have lib folder and inside this we have main.dart file ok and we have also more folder like android ios and inside this uh, we have also a lib folder ok in the root directory and in the ios folder we have a class my device info plugin class where we will write our all ios logics okay and in the example folder uh, we have also a pubsec yml file and uh, here we are importing my device info plugin and we are assigning the path here okay now i will work inside this uh, my device info plugin class so firstly i am going to take one variable uh, flutter result ok and after this I am going to remove this and uh, write this ok so I am initializing this uh, flutter result here inside this handle method and we are checking this method uh, call dot method dot element equals so if we will get this method then we are extracting this message uh, from this ok so because we will pass this message from our flutter code and we will get this message here and we are passing this message inside this get device info method uh, this method we will create here ok so here uh, we are passing the message inside this function and now here I am fetching all the details of this device like uh, current system name model name system version and all ok and this is the json string where we are storing all the variables and uh, we are passing this json string inside this self dot flutter result callback so we will get this callback into our uh, flutter uh, project ok and we will use that uh, parameters and we will show that all the parameters over the UI so now this is ok so our next step is to work on this my device info dot dart file so here I am going to remove this and just remove this also and importing two uh, things like convert flutter services and now I am going to take method channel here and we will assign this unique name and uh, we will take one more method here so the method name should be match with this method name uh, which we are checking here into our ios code like get device info ok the method name must be same and here we are passing the message ok parameter and we are extracting into our ios code ok so here we are invoking this method and we are passing message and after this we are returning this result and we are uh, decoding that result ok so this is the unique key of this method channel name so we will have to uh, use this same uh, uh, method channel name because we are registering into our ios code ok
so now open this pubsec yml file and here you can see this is the my device info plugin uh, which we are importing and this will be the same name as our project name okay and this is the path uh, which you have to assign that where uh, your plugin is okay now this is the main dot dart file which is available into our example project so now i am going to remove this unwanted files and i am going to work on this main dot dart file so from here i'll call all the uh, functions so uh, firstly i am going to declare all the parameters okay so uh, these all parameters uh, we will show over the ui so i have declared all the parameters here like platform model manufacturer and after that after that i have created one method that is get device info and uh, inside this we are calling the uh, calling our my device info class okay so this is the my device info class firstly we will have to call this and after this we will have to uh, call our method which is available inside this uh, class so the method name is get device info method and uh, uh, inside method we are passing message so here we need to pass the message okay so this is the way to call the mediator class uh, which will communicate uh, between flutter code and the swift code swift native code okay so uh, we are taking init state and uh, we are calling this method and after this we will show all the parameters okay which we are getting from the native code so here i am i have taken one column and inside this we are taking multiple text and uh, we are showing all the uh, parameters okay uh, like uh, system name model platform version and all okay so this is the mediator class which is taking the data from ios code and sending back to the flutter code now i am going to run this project so just navigating to this example project and uh, run this flutter project so you can see here uh, all the data is showing here like model manufacturer and all okay 